hi lovelies welcome back to my channel to my new and old subscribers a very big warm welcome to you please don't forget to subscribe to this channel follow this page like share and comment for you to be notified whenever a new video is being uploaded in today's video i'll be showing you how i make my homemade pizza from scratch so keep watching and let's get started firstly we are going to start by activating our yeast Add some warm water into a bowl, add little sugar, dry yeast, mix to combine. Cover and let it rise for like 6 to 10 minutes depending on the yeast you are using. After 10 minutes now, this is how it looks like, set it aside. Next, mix all the dry ingredients and set it aside. Next, pour in your activated yeast in a mixer. Add the flour mixture bit by bit. Cover and mix for about 2 minutes. 2 minutes now, add some olive oil. Mix for another one minute. That is the total of three minutes. If you are using your hand to knead, it takes five minutes. Stand mixer takes three minutes. Food processor takes 40 seconds. Rub in little olive oil in a bowl. Then put the dough in. Cover the dough with a towel or plastic wrap and allow it to rise or until it doubles in size. One hour later, it has doubled in size. Now go ahead and punch it down. We don't need to knead this for long because our mixer has done it. Now go ahead and sprinkle some flour on your work surface. Place the dough and roll it out using your rolly pin. Roll to your desired size or shape. Grease the pan with some olive oil, then place the dough. Poke holes all over the portion of the dough. Brush the surface with some olive oil. Feel free to top in any sauce ingredients of your choice. Just the way I'm doing here on the screen. Once you are done topping it up with the orishi rishis, transfer the pizza to the preheated oven and bake until the crust is brown and cheese is melted. This is usually 10 to 15 minutes, but keep an eye on it. Yeah, the 10 to 15 minutes depend on the thickness of the dough, temperature of your oven and the amount of topping on your pizza. After 12 minutes now removed from the oven, our pizza is done and ready. It is time to cut into pieces and enjoy with any chill drink of your choice. It tasted so super delicious, yummy delicious, and tantalizing. Yes. Hope you find this video helpful. Thank you all for watching and see you in my next video. Remain blessed. Bye.